My nieces keep calling me, so my video might just stop at any moment. I'm really sorry. But anyways, well, let's just get on with it. So the first thing I'm going to pull out is this homemade Find the Raisin. So I was going to put beads in it, but I decided I don't want to waste all my beads and nuts that I don't even go off. Well, not the nuts that we've got, the red nuts. So, and also raisin. We've had these raisins for ages and they have not gone off. So here is the raisin. Can you see the raisin? Can you spot the raisin? I can. And first place, just find the raisin in a bottle. And it's very noisy, so I would not recommend, you know... I would not recommend um, taking this to school, but I would like it, like, for home and stuff. Okay. The next thing is this fidget spinner. I'm going to show you just random stuff. You, you'll, I'll tell you if I've bought it or not, but I've obviously bought this. And it lights up, which is really cool. You'll be able to see it better in a dark, but that one lights up. I've got two fidget spinners from my collection from ages ago. Remember when I bought fidget spinners ages ago? When they was very, very popular. I have the other one somewhere. I don't exactly know where it is. But let's move on to this mini pack, which I did and I've had here for a long time. Here is this one. It's obviously where you pull it out and you put it back together, which I love these. They're actually amazing. I actually love them. Okay, that's that. And then we've also got... Another one, which is a pink one, and a orange and red one, which is amazing. So then I've also got these caps, these twisters, and basically you just twist it, which is amazing. You just twist it like that, and then you, you can grab hold of it like that and twist it, or you can twist it with just your finger and your thumb, which is, I actually find these really satisfying. I won't recommend taking them to school because when you squish it, it can actually make that noise. You never know. So don't want you guys to get told off in school. The next thing is my homemade squishy balls. This this one's got powder in it. It just feels really, really good. This one has also got powder in it, but this one's a bit different because I've put air in it as well, where it goes like that, which is amazing. Then I've also got one with nuts in. It's like the beaded, beaded ones, but it's a bit more crunchier and, you know, and also it's a bit more silent. Oh yeah, I think this is, no, that's the same fidget spinner. Anyways, that's all in this mini bag. Okay, let's move on to the next one. The next one is I've got some magic balls. They're actually, I call them scruff balls. <laughs> Might be weird, but I call them scruff balls. Basically, they're the ones that like stick together and you can shape them into things. Just like, I don't know what other people call them, but I call them scruff balls and they're actually really really nice to play with a nice fidget toy and they're actually brand new i found them in my loft and they're brand new so i decided to add them to my collection the next thing is oh my god i am so excited right now so i found this in my town and it's literally an orby dolphin squishy and it's really 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 beautiful like as soon as i saw it i'm like yes this is definitely going in my fidget collection but yeah it's just amazing i just hope it doesn't pop one day because i don't really want it to pop love <laughs> but yeah it's amazing i have to keep it in the packet because it's a bit sticky so that's that the next thing is these little bottles with a little plastic bag over them this is actually a diy one which is really cute which is really cute and that's very loud so i wouldn't recommend taking it into school but you push it down and you can put the air back in it and it's just i've got two of these um the other one is here somewhere there it is i've got two of them just in case um, one breaks um the next thing is i've got some squishes let me just get them um, I have got other squishes, but these are my newest ones, which I found in town when I was finding my Arby squishy. So I think this is all of them. I think, actually, I think I've got a couple more somewhere, but we'll find them. So I've got a frog one. I don't know if you can see the detail. It's like, they like came in this pack. It's kind of slow rising, not that much though. It just comes straight back up. And it's just, it's not like any more details. It's just got the face as a frog and it says on the back of the packet, but it's like a blind bag kind of thing. Um, and there's really cute squishies that 
really nice. And then I got this one is like a lot harder, but these ones are a lot more softer. So some are soft and some are hard. But this one is a little duck, I'm pretty sure, and it's really cute. Uh, I have got some for trading, so I've got like two of these ones, which I'm probably going to trade for something what the girls have got. So, Because they have got, the girls have been making their own stuff as well, but I asked them, do you want me to make you a mini pack? And they said yes, so that's really nice of me. <laughs> and I've also got two cat ones, which the girls, when I showed them that, I said I might put one of these up for trade. So it was like, yes, as soon as you get home, we'll be doing that. I am going home today. Um, I am sad, but I'm also happy. Um going home but i don't know what time because sometimes i go home really really late i don't know but here's the two cat ones then i've also got a little pig this one's like really really more soft i don't know if you can tell on camera this one's like more firm right so let's question so that one comes up a lot faster because it's more firm and I don't know why, but the pig is one of my favourites. Then I've also got this, which is like a tiger or a lion. It says it on the back, but I don't have the packets. And this one's really, really soft as well. Then I've also got the first one I got was the elephant. And it's actually really firm like this one. This one's a lot more firmer, but this one's a bit firm. So yeah, that's all the squishies I have got on me at the moment. So the next thing is this other little pack. This has got my sliders and my other things in my sliders and basically basically i'll do how to make sliders if you really want to know but basically you get a, like a, a lock bag i don't know i think it's like a ziplock bag or something and you just go like that and you literally just slide them against i've also got other things at home like poppers where instead of me sliding them and cutting the end off do you know like when you cut the end off then you can slide it i didn't cut the end off and i made them poppers which is really good i call them poppers i don't know what anyone else calls them so yeah it's really nice i've got three of them then the next thing is i've got this little beaded bobble and basically what you do is you can just play with it you can wrap it around your fingers and it's just really really cute and the beads on it are so cute so yeah that's all for that bag okay this video is going to be a lot longer than i expected but it's fine the next thing i've got i've got multiple of these poppers i've got one let me find the others i've got two one two three I think I only got three so far, which is amazing. Amazing. Okay, the next item I'm trying to get out, as you can see, you probably already know what this is if you've been watching my other videos. But if you haven't, please subscribe because I am really, really happy with how many subscribers I've got at the moment. And I just really want you guys to subscribe and make me even more happy because ever since i've figured out i have that many subscribers i'm actually really excited so i might as well show you these ones so this is like a green lollipop stick with a blue pipe cleaner and basically you move the beads across and it's just really fun this one is a purple stick with a blue stick and it's just nice to play with then this one is a plain blue cat's cradle this one i've got a rainbow one here wait let me just get out actually i don't think this is the rainbow one yeah the pink one is the rainbow one which is this one this is extra extra long then this one is the blue okay that's not even supposed to be on there but this is the blue yellow and purple mixed together one and yellow which is really cute and then this one is silver and it's got like a little thing on it this is not the girls this is my one i made two of them ones then i have also got these i've got this one which is yellow and green and then i've got the a sparkly red one which you've got beads for put that there then i've also got this is kind of like a Halloween one, like a gooey kind of one. This is like a orange and green little slide. Okay. Then I've also got these little pipe cleaners. 
with what's mixed with two colours, which is amazing. And these are actually really good fidgets because you can make anything out of them. You can just play them around. And they're silent, which is good for school. I've got a couple of them. This is a pink and purple one. That one's a green and blue one. And I think that's it for them. No, I have actually got another one, which is a orange and red one. And the next thing I pull out is this one. And this is a pom-pom. This is, a, I actually poked a hole in it to get all the air out, that's the best part. But this is like a pom-pom squishy ball and it's got pom-poms in it. I don't know if you can see that's a circle. And yeah. The next thing I've got, this is the thing what I've bought. This is two slimes. This is a purple slime and a blue slime. The next thing is I have got these, this other slime and I this is yellow and green. The next thing I've got is these little things, this is like a fidget toy rubber and basically you put the shirts back together. Also you can just twiddle them around your fingers if you just want to do something. I don't know, but this is just a lot more fun to build. I've got yellow, pink, green, red and blue and purple so i've actually already got some of these but these are really nice just to play with and put all the pieces together so yeah that's that the next thing is i have got this plain stick with the sparkly blue pipe cleaner where you can just cross the next thing is i've got a christmasy kind of one this is weird because when i'm filming this is not even near christmas but it looks kind of Christmassy and I had this when it was Christmas. It is a red and green little homemade toy, fidget toy. And then I've actually found another one of these. This is a plaited one though. This is green, purple and blue all together and it's actually really cute. The next thing is I've got like this and it's like twiddles around your fingers and you can move the strings and that's just amazing. Um, the next thing I've got is obviously the same thing as the girls. It looks like a little bracelet, but it isn't. You can grab it and you can move all the beads across. The next thing I've got another little nut squishy, which is amazing. Obviously, amazing. Another thing that I have bought is a fidget cube. I really bad at fidget cubes. I was trying not to mess this up. But then I tried to, I don't know when like people do that and then that. I was doing that, I put it back to normal and then I did it too much and forgot the way I did it. And now I'm just trying to fix it. But I don't think it's going to work. So here is my fidget cube. The next thing I have got, this is, looks very just like a piece of crap. But it isn't. It's actually, you lift it up and you can push it down. It's not the best fidget toy I've ever made, but it was my, one of my first ones. So... That's probably why. And I've had that for a long time. The next one is I've got some of these little stirrer things, and you basically pop, pull them apart, and you can make a bunch of stuff with them. You can make separate them, you can put them back together. It's just really nice. Little set. I've actually think I've got another set of them. Yes, I have got another set. So I've got two lots of them. Then also the next thing is I've got a yellow and pink little bead thing. this video isn't very long then the next one is i've got these little ones that are tied together like a red and orange one you can just move them all around and it's just really amazing they're two straws actually the next thing is i've got another one of these red and purple little beads then i've also got the sparkly gold one Oh, this is another one of them little walls, but this one's gotten a little better and you can literally move the wall wherever you want it to go. This is another straw one, a green and pink one. Then I've got this little blue little of them straws. The next thing is I've got a plain one, which I'm gonna probably going to decorate a plain one. Then I have got a little purple one which is really cute then i've got another little popper which i forgot to show you and then pretty sure these are all the same things like i've got some more of these which come apart and then some more of these little twizzlers more and then another one comes apart 
And then, yeah, I've got an orange and blue one of them. And I've also got another Twizzler. And that's it for mine, which I have a lot more than the girls. But yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. Make sure to check out that video there. Make sure to subscribe. I love you and bye.